let me first know that I'm here uh, in Rome in my quality of uh, president of the uh, 28th Regional Conference that took place uh, in March in Tunis. The conference went uh, very well and uh, I'm here to present the report of the conference and I met with the uh, council members in their uh, 194th, uh, 49th session and I did convey to them that the report really uh, uh, reported on the uh, recommendation in Tunis that took place in Tunis. The, uh, uh, the conclusions of the conference. I did mention that the uh, report incorporated the declaration of uh, civil society organizations and their participation was really uh, well, uh, well, uh, well noted and remarked in Tunis. Also the report incorporated the uh, ministerial declaration and in that uh, point of view, I would like to say that uh, it's about this will uh, reinforce our engagement uh, in Tunisia uh, to reinforce the, and strengthen the collaboration with FAO, Tunisia FAO. Uh, the report stressed two recommendations. The first is uh, about the role that uh, youth can play in agriculture and the development of agriculture. We are aware of that and uh, we can only attract them by uh, making a, a propice, an environment propice, a good environment for them, make agriculture look as a modern, modern sector and they can uh, work in, uh, in a favorable environment and we can also make them involved in the development of the sector. So this one was one of the uh, main uh, recommendations of the report. The second one is, uh, of course, after analyzing the situation of agriculture and uh, its development in the whole continent, we, uh, we are aware about the uh, the detailed program of uh, development of uh, the whole sector and uh, also we have uh, we made the engagement to be more uh, uh, reactive and more uh, outgoing concerning the uh, investment in, in the sector so these were the main the main two recommendations of the report that I uh, conveyed to the council uh, of course, I also had the pleasure to meet the DG now in his office and uh, uh, thanked him to set aside some time to meet with me. And we discussed points of uh, uh, collaboration between the uh, FAO and Tunisia. I was pleased to hear uh, that uh, FAO will always support Tunisia after this uh, transition, uh, during this uh, transition period and uh, uh, he looked very favorable to uh, having more, more support and more uh, collaboration with, with, with my country Tunisia. I think, well, indeed, he, he did talk about this, uh, this uh, conference and he did convey an invitation to, to me to, to be present and to attend this conference. This is a very good initiative, I think, and this is the only international conference for this year that FAO will be holding. Uh, of course, this is an invitation not only for the uh, ministers of agriculture but also for the health ministers that are uh, concerned by the uh, nutrition aspects. Uh, I did uh, convey to him that I will do all my best to be here, particularly that uh, uh, Tunisia now is talking uh, with the voice of Africa, so I, I will be here to, to represent the, uh, all ministers of agriculture in, uh, in the whole continent so that I can later on when I uh, uh,
see them and uh, discuss with them about issues of agriculture and nutrition, I can convey to them the, uh, the recommendation of the conference. So I will do my best to be part of it.